I am going to explain about 16 to 1 multiplexer uh, design using very long enzylings. Actually, MUX means it is many to one output lines or else 2 power n input lines to single output. Single output uh, is called as multiplexer. Here, n indicates uh, the selection lines. Uh, for example, uh, n value is 2 means that is single output. So, means that is 4 input lines to 1 output line. So, here n is equal to 2 means these are the selection lines. Selection lines. Similarly, if you are uh, assumed that is n value is 3 means you, you may get that is 8 to 1 max. 8 to 1 max. So, here 3 selection lines are required for that. So, here uh, we can consider this. Uh, 4 is to 1 max and there are uh, 2 power n means 2 power 2 to 1 output. So here n value is 2, there are 2 selection lines are required. When it is 0, 0, we need to select i0. When that is inputs are 0, 0, that is these are the inverters. So we need to select i0. When the inputs are 0, 1, we need to select i1. When the inputs are 0, s0, s1 is 0, s1 is 0 s1 is 0 and this is 1 we need to select i1 like that uh, we will get the output we will get the output here so for this we need to write the code for that uh, there are 3 4 inputs i0 to i1 there are uh, 2 inputs selection lines and one output and these are the wires uh, for, uh, we need to mention after that uh, like uh, just assume that these are the ABC wire you can give the any names and N1 N2 wires these are also N1 N2 N2 wires and uh, these are also wires A1 A2 A3 A4 and coming to the there are two NOT gates are there in our circuit we need to mention that here you can see this not gate this is and this is a not gate not gate output and not gate input we need to mention so n1 is the output and selection 1 is the input and n2 is the output selection 0 is the input and there are four and gates are there one two three four and gates we need to mention what is the input a1 is the input and these are the uh, sorry a1 is the output a1 is the output here is saying that and gate these are not a1 a b c d this is a1 B1, A2, A3, A4, A1, A2, A3, A4, A3, A4. These are the outputs for AND gate. A2 is an output and these are the input. N, N0 and N1, N2. And A3 is the output and these are the inputs. And the fourth gate, AND gate also, we can write it. Then finally, so we need to write about our gate code and our gate and our gate output and uh, our gate inputs are a1 a2 a3 a4 we are mentioned a1 a2 a3 a4 so these are these are a1 wires are a1 a2 a3 a4 these are the wires so that is about 4 is to 1 max. Similarly, we need to write uh, the 16 is to 1 max by using 4 is to 1 max. And they, here also 4 max are there. So from this, these are the selection lines uh, 0, 1, 2, 3. 0, 1, 2, 3. So here also, when the selection lines are 0, 0, 0, 0, we need to select A0. When the selection lines are 0, 0, 0, 0, AB also 0, 0, we need to select. A0. I am assuming A0 or D0. I am assuming here we need to select uh, that is D0. We need to select D0. So like that when the inputs are 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, we need to select D1. We need to select D1. So based on the uh, selection lines we can get the output by using 4 is to 1 max also. Here also we know there are 15 inputs and uh, 4 selection lines and single output and these are the wires there are 4 wires are there 0 to 1 from that uh, we need to there are 4 multiplexers are there max 1 uh, I will tell you here max name this is we can assume any name max output is uh, 0 m a 0 is assuming here also you can give any name and inputs are 3 lines 4 lines 0 to d, d 0 d 1 d 2 d 3 inputs and selection lines are 2, 3. Here you can see this. Selection lines are 2, 3. 
So like that we need to write the four multiplexer output and finally this is an output for the fifth one, fifth, fifth multiplexer output. So this is the way to write the code and now we, we are going to execute by using, by using For that, uh, we need to open Xilinx software. So, first we have to install in our system or else laptop. Then go to file, left side corner. go to file new project so i am writing new max new max i am writing new max 16 new any name you can give it there and then go for left side new max new source select very log module i have given new max New max 16 here also we can give any name dot v file you should add this is the input file it's compulsory then click on finish so you will get like this here we need to write the code whatever the code you have mentioned there that code we need to write so this is uh, the same code I am copying here same code copy and uh, here so but i have given new max 16 so for that only new max 16 yes so here uh, whatever the name you have given that max name we need to give it here new max 16 because we are recalling here here so that's why we need to give whatever the name you have mentioned there that's the same name we need to give it here because we are recalling that 4 is to 1 max function yes now save it save it and then go for left side check syntax click on check syntax it will take 30 seconds if no errors are there you can get it uh, here if errors are there you will get it like that line fit syntax error and module here and module two times are there so that's why I remove that one yes now again save it and again go for check syntax So again it will take uh, 30 seconds time, yes, uh, without any errors uh, it is executed, then go for URTL schematic if required, I am going for RTL schematic, it will take 30 seconds time. Then we need to go for, uh, yes, we will get it like that, uh, then click on OK. You can go both the ways, either this one or this one, start to top module or else uh, explore uh, wizard, then click on OK and then add, add, create schematic, yes, this is our required schematic, uh, we can see this. Then you can go for uh, simulation, first part is over, then implementation part, then go for the simulation, so left side you can see this uh, here then uh, go for this again new source click on that new source and uh, very log test fixture select that one and then i uh, have given new max new max new max 16 underscore tv test bench dot v again we need to add dot v file so for uh, distinguish between them so i have given test bench then click on next click on next finish so here uh, we need to write our uh, required test bench 
So we will get it like this. Uh, already I have a test bench. So this is the test bench program I will tell you. So copying and here then yes here in the test bench we are giving like this when the inputs are 16 b 0 0 0 0 0 1 we need to get output is 0 0 0 when the inputs are 0 0 0 0 0 1 we need to get uh, the output should be 0 0 0 1 and similarly in the third position so like this uh, we can get it so then again save it control s rl save button is here uh, we can anyone we can use so and uh, then click on this click on the test bench you will get it like this is is uh, sim simulator then behavioral check syntax click on yes so without any, any errors you are, it is executed then click on simulate behavior model so it will take uh, 30 seconds uh, we'll get it output uh, yes this is the output and then uh, click on this top side you can see this uh, zoom to full view and click on that uh, then you will uh, clearly you will get the output so this is the uh, output when the inputs are 0 0 0 0 so the 16 bits then you will get it uh, this one so then this is the input then you will get it uh, our required output like this this is the way to execute 16 to 1 mux thank you